Alright, hey YouTube, this is Flaming Goldfish 23 here, and this is going to be a video on how to edit and change the um, strings, also known as uh, slider text, on your iPod Touch or iPhone. It's the little slider thing right here. Yep. And you can, and I'm going to be showing you how to change this one up here as well. What you need is a jailbroken iPod Touch or iPhone, and you need to have internet, and you need to be running WinSCP because you need to SSH in this video. Alright, the first thing you're going to need to do is, um, on your home screen, right here, just right click, go down to New, and select a folder. You can name this whatever you'd like. I'm just going to name it Slider Text. S L I D E R. I'm doing this one handed, so. Excuse me if I take forever. Alright, then just open up that folder. Then, when you're in this folder, you need to right click, go back down to New, select Folder once again. And then this one needs to specifically be named Bundles with a capital B U N D L. E S bundles. Uh, crappy camera. I'm sorry. Um, and just click enter. Then you need to open up that, and then right click, new folder, and then this one needs to be named com dot apple dot springboard. So that needs to be c o m dot a p P P L E dot S P R I N G B O A R D A er C O M dot A P P L E dot S P R I N G B O A R D and all of that needs to be a uh, lowercase none of it's capitalized but then once you're done with that just click enter and you need to open that one up right click down in new one last time and then make one last folder and it will be e n dot l p r o j that's e n dot l p r o j all right once you have that all um typed in then you need to click enter and then open that up and now uh, right click go down the new and instead of clicking on a folder you go to a uh, text document and before you rename this one um, you're going to want to minimize this and go uh, I'm running this on Vista uh, for all this is this is the only way I know how to do this so sorry I didn't say that sooner but you go here and computer and then since we're on Vista it's going to be under organize and then folder and search options click view and then right here it's going to say uh, hide extensions for known file types and it's going to be checked so you're going to uncheck it click apply and then OK and then you can just exit out of this and then open back up the folder and now you just right click on it go down to rename and name it springboard so it needs to be capital S P R I N G capital B O A R D so S capital S P R I N G capital B O A R D and then click enter and then right click on it uh, click open and it's going to pop up with this and I have put uh, some notes in the description so what you're going to need to do is just copy those and uh, whoa that's a little big How's that? Uh, and then you're going to need to paste them onto the notepad right here. They should look like those ones. I don't know if you see it, but there are a bunch of commands. Away, lock, label, your text goes here, yada yada yada. Uh, 
once that's up you need to, uh, away lock label is the first one uh, right here it's that one so uh, all you need to do is replace your text goes here with what you want it to be so what I have on there right now is uh, you turn me on so uh, you just type that in there or type whatever you'd like it so I'd just be you I recommend uh, doing this in lowercase because there's it uh, puts more space on there capitalized sometimes it doesn't show the whole thing so just do that and then after you type that in there don't delete the qu anything but your text goes here and then power down lock is the power down thing and it just says turn the power off uh, you should know what that is uh, and then replace your text goes here with whatever you like I have a uh, slide at own risk so I'm going to change that right slide at own risk and then I'm not sure what slide to answer is so I haven't done it so um, I just leave that one blank then you just need to save it and then you can exit out of that and then what you need to do is click uh, right click on uh, springforward.txt go down to rename and change the txt at the end to strings s-t-r-i-n-g-s -S, strings and then yes pop up with that little thing just click yes and then um this is when you need to SSH so you can just get out of that uh, then you're going to need to connect to SSH for Windows it's more than likely or it is going to be WinSCP so that's what I have here is WinSCP uh, once you get into that you need to go up one hold on alright and then uh scroll down to stash let it load I guess okay uh, when SCP is not responding of course hold on I have bad internet connection apparently so just hold on I just need to reconnect my computer real quick. Sorry, you guys. This is kind of unexpected. Did not think it was going to do this, but it, it did. So. Now that I am connected again, um... What you need to do is go back into WinSCP. I have a specific folder for it, so. SCP. Alright, yeah, you go up one, open up stash, and then you're going to see the themes. Uh, what you're going to need to do is drag that folder into the themes. I already have it on my iPod, so uh, I don't need to, but you're going to drag it into themes, and uh, actually, yeah, I'll just do it. You just drag it into themes, and then click copy. Uh, and it's going to copy it onto there just exit out of that and then that should be just about it uh, now you just go back on your iPod or iPhone and it should be on there so you can exit out of this now okay and then it should be on there to whatever you had it set to which should be uh whatever you set it to. Alright, so, uh,
thank you guys, and uh, please comment, resubscribe if this video helped. Um, just send in comments on what you might need help on, and I should, and I'm gonna try and make a video on it. So uh, I'll see you guys next time.